Hello, I'm Victoria Wynn. So, welcome to the Celestial Skies and Heavenly Clouds course. This is level three. Um, level one is already not um, a simple course by any means. So, if you're here, level three, um, and you've probably done level one, and hopefully you've done level two because it's um, takes you like in an in-between kind of place and it focuses on really advanced geodes and then here's level three we're doing things like using gold leaf copper leaf silver leaf and then also a new addition to this course is that we are using some genuine gemstones like clear quartz or amethyst or gold obsidian. Just really beautiful stuff that um, looks like it would be floating around in space anyway. So it just kind of made sense to start using some of the Wind Modern Art uh, genuine gemstones. So I want to grab some of the pieces that um, will be in this course. This is one of my pieces called the Earth Pour. You can see this has got like a butterfly blue lux metallic powder in it and there's some prism powder and uh, this piece is that high shine coat is a verithane and I teach you also in this course um, and in my others as well, different ways to put that beautiful high gloss protective coat on your piece without it having the brush strokes or looking uneven. And is where I was talking about some of those gemstones. This one has clear quartz in it. Um, and then we've got gold leaf. This is the um, shooting star. I was like, what is this one? Um, shooting star, I have a few of them. I really love this technique. And I will say that uh, I have found in this course, boy, each one is near and dear to me. They, they all have a special meaning and purpose and time of my life that I created them and this one really shocked me. This one brought me to thoughts of the heavens and what's on the other side for us and um, people and pets that have passed. Uh, so there is um, one video where I get a bit choked up because some unexpected um, emotions came up while I was painting the piece. So even though these are instructional courses, I put my heart into them just like I would um, a piece for myself, a gift, or a commission. So even when I'm teaching, I still pause, I ask myself what's next, I listen to my intuition, I go with my gut, I do all these things that I recommend that you do, and I do them live, you know, essentially in these courses, unedited videos, and uh, and in this one, while I was talking, I got a bit choked up as I was um, recalling some, some memories. So I have found as I've had some testers um, go through the course that I'm not the only one that this course is affecting in a really beautiful way, um, some spiritual kind of manner. Uh, I, I don't know how else to, to describe it other than people are really connecting with loved ones um, in particular in this course as they're painting things like stars and heavenly clouds and galaxies and universes and it's bringing some stuff up for people and including me so this is a really really special course uh, it was emotionally exhausting because not only are the techniques that I innovated 
um, they can get advanced and very layered. But to add the emotional side to it, oh my goodness, like this is this is intense yet peaceful yet still keep it fun. So welcome. I'm so excited to have you and if you are um, ever needing help with products, you know, what was used or you have questions as you're going through the course, you can always comment within the course or you can email winmodernartanswers at gmail.com. Um, we love when you tag Win Modern Art or myself, Victoria Wynn, on Facebook, Instagram, whatever your platform is, we're probably there. And we love when you tag us in you know, things that you create, that, that you learned in the course. We'd love to see what, what you're doing because, you know, of course, no two are ever going to be alike. You could use the same color scheme as me. Uh, you could use the same metallic powders and still it's going to be, it's all you, right? So I love when, when I'm tagged and you guys share what you're creating. So please um, continue to do that. And um, I really do personally, I look at all those and, and you're welcome to invite me to your social media platforms. You can follow me on Facebook as uh, Victoria Wynn and under Wynn Modern Art, and then also Instagram, um, Wynn Modern Art, uh, Twitter, Victoria Wynn, and that will shift to Wynn Modern Art as well. So again, um, I'm really, really excited to have you, and I'm excited to hear the experiences that you have going through this course. Um, there's We have five-star reviews on this course. Uh, if you have a five-star review, also, by all means, please share. You'll see on winmodernart.com when you go to the Level 3 Celestial Skies and Heavenly Clouds course that you'll see other people's reviews, and some people are um, getting really open and, and vulnerable, actually, on all the courses. But if, if you would like to read through those and leave your own review, um, I personally absolutely love to read those. I... I'm here to not just teach uh, artistic techniques, but I'm here to make a difference and do some good. So when I do, then that just lights up um, my whole day and my whole countenance. So please, I'd love to, to hear from you. And we have some really magical lessons in this, like Northern Lights, like, um, Milky Way pour, the Earth pour I just showed you, and some ways to create really wispy and soft clouds. It's uh, it's a really, really peaceful and deep um, course, but it has to be a little bit of fun because that's just part of me. So as most of you know by now, there is no editing out any mishaps that might happen. So I uh, shot a lesson recently, added it to a course, and um, camera fell fell into it. <laughs> and it was the second secondary camera, so you can see the camera from the side falling <laughs> into the piece. Um, it's it's just part of keeping it real, keeping it authentic and showing people how I deal with stressful situations and that, um, you know, sometimes it ends up being better than it was, you know, originally. So I usually figure if there's a mishap, like, you know, the, the bottle just coming right off um, or it getting clogged and then all of a sudden spurting all over, um, I tend to think, you know, probably a reason for that. I'm going to create something even better, you know, because of that mishap. So I always have that, that faith in the, in the whole situation. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me and I'm excited for you to pour your soul onto canvas or wood or tile, whatever you're pouring your soul onto. Thank you for joining me in doing that as I pour my soul onto canvas with you.